And we're here for Saturday Night Football. Week Black, six. Week six. A, a black hole has timed warped us into Saturday night instead of Sunday. So we're here and we're doing commentary. Uh, I'm Chris McLeese, the Fender's owner. And with and me. I am Jim Shuck, Portly Pounders. And right now I'm going to apologize to the bum. I would send you a bottle of liquor, but not now. Maybe later this year I'll meet up with you. <laughs> And uh, it's coming up, the coin toss came up tails again, which has been coming up a lot this season. I think that just proves that the offenders are behind the defenders. And with a nice return out to the 35. Yeah, it was the Green Ranger. Who just came back, actually. Big return for them. Yep, Rita handed in that uh, dark power sword, and he's back oh, ready to go. An amazing diving catch already. The Green Ranger immediately makes his presence felt. Starting off the game with the first down. That's always good. Yep. And, uh, we got covered across the middle. Yep. Uh, going to King Zarkon. Wow. Uh, actually, uh, Voltron, Defender of the Universe, not on the Defenders this year. So maybe the Defenders game planning right there to get him involved. Nice play action. Here we go, Vader back. Gets it to Zarkon again and breaks a oh, couple tackles whoa. and it's a touchdown. The Defenders yeah. dive and. Like I said, man, no no Voltron. I mean, you just don't have any giant robot lions back there, so I guess King Zarkon is kind of running free. The bye week really showing showing what's wrong with how our defenders right now. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, so uh, the defenders strike real fast. Uh, obviously, the Death Star home field advantage coming up big for them. I'm so little happy with plenty of help for this return. Getting, all, getting right around them. Good return out to the 35. All right. The uh, Sarah Kerrigan struggled against the, the slouches, so hopefully the bye week got her wide open. Oh. oh. Tried to run and got nothing. It wasn't a sack, though, at least. Yeah. It was, it was bad play. Oh, oh my God. I don't know the Beyonder manipulating reality to sack Sarah Kerrigan for a loss. I thought it said the Beyonce. <laughs> Oh, man. Oh, wait. Alex, wide open. Bottom of the field. Nice catch. Ooh. And 20, 10, Vance. Nope. Touchdown. Touchdown. Alex Vance. Lance Vance, star of Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. <laughs> Touchdown. <laughs> Alex Vance from Half-Life 2, Gordon Freeman's main squeeze, uh, obviously used her auto pistol to knock down that offender and get into the end zone. And it's good. 7-7, seven to seven, about halfway through the first quarter. Uh, it's a good game already. So apparently, uh, defense not a thing. Uh, Green Ranger, uh, possibly preparing to summon the Dragon Sword, gets out to pass the 30. Another good starting field position for the offenders here. All right, uh, is it play action? No. Oh, oh yeah. Blitz and the Arbiter. The Arbiter breaks through the line with a plasma sword and sacks Darth Vader. As long as it's the Halo 2 Plasma Sword. <laughs> plasma Sword on lightsaber action there, and Darth Maul gets stuffed for nothing. nothing. What a punk. Third and 15. Defenders need a play here. Oh, this isn't it. <laughs> yeah, we're just going to run on third and long into the Defenders' number one ranked rush defense. G good job, Offenders. Good punt from Predator here. Oh, Jesus Christ, good Bombing punt. it down the field. Play is barely, barely gets there. <laughs> Wow. And stumbles out to the seven. That was not great. Let's see if the offenders can put some more points. Defenders can put some more points in there. Right. Uh, oh, Alex is free on that play again. Connected and... Jumping in his Corvette to the 30. <laughs> Alex just untouched. I got to get touchdown. in. My good. You know, we always talk about... Uh, Samus and uh, Duke Nukem, and there's always players like Alex Vance who just find ways to get open and make plays, man. It's great. I'm pretty sure she's actually uh, the leading receiver for the defenders right now with those plays. I hope so. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, the Green Ranger does not want to be shown up by Alex Vance, so I'm sure he's about to pull something off here. I'll pass the 20. Almost to the 30. 27. See if they can do something with the ball this time. I hope not. And they are going to run at the defenders again. Gain, nope, nope, nothing. I thought he gained at least not one. Not a great game plan by the offenders. Here it comes again. The, the same play? Yep, uh, same play. 
fucking four this time, at yeah, least. Yeah, he's getting a little further. He's starting to... Starting to swing those lightsabers around. And the third time in a row. Wow. Um, I don't really know what to say to that. Here comes another punt from the Predator. Yeah, well, he's, he's a good punter. Oh, shit, that looks good. Oh, well, that's not that bad. 14. That's not that bad. Oh. Fumble. Oh. No! Oh, my God! It's the Merc with the Mouth Deadpool! Obviously hired by the offenders to take out Leo Organa and score that touchdown. And I do believe that right now he is on the field breaking the fourth wall. I don't know. Unfortunate. An unfortunate turn of events, Jim. You knew it was going to happen sooner or later. Your team usually caught, gets three or four fumbles a game. <laughs> God, they do. We need to work on ball control, obviously. On solo, I was at the 16 and he stopped. Yeah, the uh, special teams for the offenders just playing out of their minds right now. Turned into Carbonite on 15. Oh, play action to Duke Nukem. And Gordon Freeman up top pulls out the gravity gun and makes the catch. Morgan Freeman slowly reads a story, falls <laughs> them to sleep, and gets to the 20 yard line. Uh, let's see, maybe. We haven't run once yet, I don't think. And, uh, oh, Sam is open over the middle. There's no need to run at this point. They're just <laughs> leaving everything open across the middle and touchdown defenders. Uh, Sarah Carey with her third touchdown. This one to Samus Aran. And, uh, really just the defenders not covering the pass at all. Yeah, picking up, picking up Harkless defenders defense here. Uh, you, see, you would think that they would do better. They got Galactus back there. They have the Phoenix Force. Uh, you know, the Beyonder. You think that they would be trying harder, but maybe they just think they're so powerful they don't have to try. Uh, a fatal flaw in evil. And the offenders do have the 11th ranked overall defense right now. That's not showing at all right now. Wide open across the middle. Well, Kings are not again. Damn it. How do the, def how do the defenders not have Voltron? Looks like the same route that Samus runs when she's always open across yeah, the middle. Yeah, very so. similar, except he's the, the second running back instead of the tight end. But yeah, very similar. Just a weak spot in the zone. Here goes Vader. Yep. Uh, Using the force choke on the <laughs> linebacker there to hold him in place. Gains a nine. Yeah, we we, uh, we were working on uh, getting a tune to the force. And we were going to try to run outside. I don't think that First got down. Him. Nope. I don't think he did. It's all right. No. They're close to field goal range. They just need to gain a few more yards. Oh, again, and oh no, breaking tackle. Oh, First I, I think the Silver Surfer came all the way from the bottom cornerback spot to save a big play there. And they're going to play it safe, go for the field goal to end the half. All right, the Titan Thanos. See, Looks like it's good. Uh, oh, use the reality gem to bounce it off the left upright. Ah. Uh, and uh, now that we're at halftime, I would like to use this time to announce that this game is sponsored by Sour Blood Rebirth. The new CD is live right now. Make sure you go pick up a copy. Available in your nearest IQ store or <laughs> anywhere else from the 1990s. <laughs> yeah. And second half, Han Solo returned to the kick. Uh, the Sour Blood's some pretty good stuff, though. I mean, Nick Dean made a fatal flaw making the Galactic Defenders, but uh, the Han music's pretty solid. Tackles out to the 27. All right. Uh, all the Defenders finally running. They finally run and get about five. Jim Rayner, nice, nice pickup right there. I'm, I'm, we're glad to have him back. He was out with Space Madness for much of the beginning of the season, and they did not cover Alex again. Oh, but underthrown. Throw, still made the catch and breaks yeah. three tackles. Alex had to come back for it that time. Down to the 26. They are just not covering her. <laughs> Apparently, they don't think she's a threat. And, uh, uh, oh. Three or four receivers open. Yeah, uh, they, it looks like they stayed in zone. It's not going to work out for him. Touchdown, number three of the day. Yeah, that's three for Alex, four for Sarah Kerrigan. Um, I, the offenders are just not covering. I I think Galactus is just eating a planet right now somewhere. He's not paying attention to what's going on on the yeah, field. Yeah, just hanging back there. Way too much. Way too many of the receivers were open on that. I think I counted <laughs> yeah. three open on that. And then Kerrigan just picked one. She picked Alex because she's been playing well. Green Ranger out to 37. Decent field position. The offenders need a touchdown here, though. They can't fall yeah. behind again. That by that much more. Uh, 
and oh, here first we go. Green Ranger. I, I think this is the first reverse to him, and he's making some moves. Tommy yeah. Oliver, uh, six yard gain, I think. Yeah, six yard gain. Uh, Darth Vader back. Has a couple of options open. Uses the force Darth to get Maul. it to Darth Maul. Force to force connection. We were actually trying to prepare for this. The power of the dark side is strong, though, Jim. Pass. He's got wow. one option across the moon. He's got Zargon right there. Yep. Oh! And he drops it. I'm not sure if that was Goku right there knocking away with a key blast or Zarkon just felt him coming and couldn't make the reception, but incomplete either way. Darth Maul being bottled up very well except on that one pass play. For some reason, I thought Zarkon was a dinosaur. <laughs> He's got wide open Green the, the, the dinosaur top. from Planet Doom. Oh, Green Ranger. Green Ranger in, in the end zone. Oh my god. Superman was up in zone, but Goku used instant transmission to deflect that pass. Another Excellent play by the here. Saiyan. This looks bad. Uh, looks bad to me too. Looks bad and oh. banked it in somehow. Thanos uses the power gem this time to force it through the uprights. This is ridiculous. How are they going to let a kicker with the Infinity Gauntlet on the field? Thanos will be kick here to turn solo. And he's bottling. Yeah, th their special teams are playing pretty well this game, Jim. Uh, run with Jim Rainer again. Makes a couple people miss. Almost gets gets the first down. Baiting the horde, just like the third. Sarah Kerrigan hands it off to the Duke, his first run of the game, and it looks breaks like a three, down. four tackles, almost breaks the fifth there, gets him across the 50 to the 40 yard line. Kicking ass and chewing bubble gum. He's all out of bubble gum. <laughs> Raider hit the middle. I like that play because uh, it gets Duke and Raider involved. Uh, Duke gets the blocks in, and then uh, Raider just kind of. It's a good strategy from the defenders here. You're up by eight points, you got one quarter left, uh, wide open. Again? Uh oh. Oh, just Over out of range. Wow. I know this is only Saturday night, but I'm going to steal a line from the Sunday night, guys. And it's a classic Saturday night overthrow. <laughs> oh, man. Duke Newcomb almost gets the first. Looks like we're going to have to try a field goal here. Yeah, just barely stopped. I could spring off a thing of racist names here, but I'll just let it go. <laughs> hey, Mrs. Duke is great. Banked off the Whoa! Cross. Did you did you see that, Jim? I'm pretty sure the Dragon Zord just fired a finger missile from the sidelines and knocked that ball off course. Something needed to happen there. Bull crap. Superman with the deflection. Terrible pass. He had a guy <laughs> streaking down the field. Looked like Zarkon. Zarkon is obviously their main player this game, and Vader taken off by himself. Darth Crossing Vader, 40, almost to the 45. Using the uh, precognition of the force to just get some big carries in the running game today. Pitch Zarkon? to Zarkon, going up top. Yeah, we just had trouble with Zarkon. He is eight yard gain on first down. This is what the defenders are. The defenders need here. <laughs> defenders, defenders. You know. And here comes the reverse. Picks up a couple blocks. Oh yeah, Green Ranger getting first on that. And he gains about nine. They're calling. Defenders. They're calling timeouts already. They know this is this, they, is, important. this is an important drive right here. They need to put some points on the board. Oh, and the Master Chief breaks through the line for the sack. What a play! And, uh, oh, Master Chief again. Oh, force push to the side. But it looks like they're gonna grab him anyway. The coal train. The coal train. Finally, those thrash ball skills starting to translate to the TFO, Jim. It only took six weeks, but there he goes. Yeah, this is Green Ranger over the top. So. Vader takes off on his own. He doesn't need help. Nah, he's not going to get it. 30 and 28. 27 there. Too far for a run. But field goal. Let's see oh, if Thanos can Thanos use another infinity gem. Can make it 3 for 3? It looks like oh, it. Oh, Thanos. Oh, my Banked goodness. It again. Thanos with the space gem. He banked him off the uprights. Are we see an onside? No, nope. no, they They're don't gonna trust their defense kick. for once. I, <laughs> I have no idea why. <laughs> that's that's a good question. Han Solo, he's in, getting about to the thirty each time. It's good field position. Let's see if they try another bomb to Vance here on the bottom. Oh, no. here goes the blitz. The Magus. Uh, no, I'm not sure if that is Magus from Chrono Trigger or the insane future Adam Warlock. But either way, he's a badass. Uh, oh, they are going to pass. Uh, the offenders forced us to pass with that sack, and Samus over the middle, picks up the first, first down. 
that was huge right there because the time's running out. The defenders are running out of time here. They need a stop. Yeah. Preferably a turnover. Yeah. Uh, Duke gets up to the Duke. final. Six, Six yards. Seven. Yeah, I mean, you know, the strategy here is just going to be to try to run out the clock or pass. Oh, no, Karen keeps it herself. Good and strategy. First down. That's more. Guard. Down to 35 seconds left. Nope. Uh, Let's wow. see what happens here. They need they, a fumble. They need a turnover. Okay, we're going to run it. Uh, nope. Yep. Oh. And touchdown. Yeah, they, they're not catching him. That's the end of the game. Jim Rayner with the game clinching 27 yard touchdown run while running out the clock. Let's see if the Green Ranger on this return can do something just to make it not so embarrassing here in this epic clash. <laughs> Well, uh, he already summoned the Dragon Zord to stop that field goal, so I don't know, man. We'll see. Might have to pull off the power flute here and see what happens on the return. Right. Long-term goal of the defenders is, is to destroy the Sword of Darkness this season and free Tommy Oliver from the evil clutches of Rita Repulsa. And, and stop. stops at the 30. Oh, that was quite the game, Jim. Uh, the offenders came in at 3-2, and two, tied with every single team in the bad snap. And they did not come up with a victory. Sarah today. Kerrigan, 87% completion, 330 yards. That's probably one of the best quarterback performances of the year so far. Yeah, and Alex Vance with four catches for 228 yards, almost five and another touchdown. Yep, that was Except for the overthrow. And, uh, you know, G Jim Rader and Duke Nukem running just enough to uh, keep the offenders' defense honest. Yep. <clears throat> Uh, heck Defenders of... held them to what, what's that? Under 200 yards total offense. So that's yeah. a way to keep one of the more potent offenses in the TFO down tonight. Yeah, I mean, uh, they, they tried to run at us, and you know, it just it wasn't enough. Well, I mean, that's the game, Jim. It was it was a great pleasure to be here on Saturday night. And if you guys think we did all right, maybe we'll get maybe we'll do some more Saturday night games this year. Who knows? Um, uh, but... Probably not. Though. This is <laughs> this is a lot of stress right here. It's hard to watch a game. Try not to pepper too many profanities. <laughs> yeah. 